Today, Kevin and I want to talk about the differences uh, between the Ben and Jerry's Chunky Monkey, we have the non-dairy vegan, and then we have the regular. And so it's been a couple weeks actually since we've had the, the vegan, but I made sure that I let it sit out because uh, with the non-dairy vegan, you have to let it sit out longer. That's just a fact. It has to sit out longer than the regular. Um, the uh, non-dairy vegan, it is about a dollar more than the regular. So if you're not vegan, then uh, you might want to think about that. Um, it is, I think, 40 calories less uh, per half cup. A half cup of the regular is 300 calories. Oh, this is not like two. 260. So it's only 40 calories fewer. Uh, this has the chunky, regular chunky monkey is using regular milk, whereas the non dairy vegan uses almond milk. So I really want to see. Uh, we haven't even opened this. No, we haven't opened it. We want to see do you get as much stuff? Does the stuff taste as good? You know. They look very similar. They do look, they, they do look very similar. Although this one has a little bit of a, of a more of a brownish creamy color probably that because of that white. almond milk yeah. which one do you want to try first now this has been sitting out well, i wanted to kind of try to put the first scoop on that lid that's what i'm gonna do although it looks like it's got tons of stuff in that first scoop it does ben and jerry's is full of stuff these give you a pretty yeah. good amount of fillings yeah there's they're called something mix-ins like Add ins? Add I don't ins. know. I immediately see um, the banana, the walnuts, walnuts yeah. chocolate. I didn't get any chocolate. I'm trying desperately to get a piece of chocolate. Is this vegan because it's a little V with the heart rate? I mean, it really doesn't tout veganism, but is that the V right there being vegan? I don't know. Mm -mm. It's weird though, because it doesn't say vegan anywhere on that container. No. Unless it says it in that little bitty V that I can't read. Right. It's small. <laughs> there are certain symbols that they use that we don't have a clue what they mean. I know it's vegan because I've read lots of articles about it. Mmm. It's got good flavor. They have banana flavor. The walnuts. I like the walnuts. I could live without the chocolate, honestly. The walnuts are very, very good. The banana flavor is good. The ice cream is uh, creamy. That dark, I don't like the chocolate. Let me try just a piece of the chocolate. I don't know if it's just too dark for me or, or what, but I like it. I mean, I like everything else. I like it. Maybe it's, it is dark. Yeah, it is a, what it is. It is a dark chocolate, but it's not bitter. I don't think it's bitter. It's just like a, a Hershey special dark. I, I also don't like it that everything else is good and soft and you get the chocolate <laughs> and it's like crunch. But the walnut, you get... A little crunch. A little crunch, but it is a softer... Not that kind of crunch. Right. Okay, now we'll try the vegan again. And like I said, we haven't had the vegan in a little bit, in a little while. And I don't think I've ever tried just the regular. Or if I have, it's been a really long time ago. Mm. That caught me off guard. That tastes sweeter. Mm. Does that taste sweeter to you? Or was it just the first? I don't know. Let me try another bite. It tastes different. I know you can't really compare vegan to regular or non-dairy to regular. That has, this is more of a, just a traditional ice cream taste that's really good. That has more of a chemical flavor in it. I like it. Yeah. And I'm shocked. Yeah. Because when we first tried it, I think I thought it was okay. Or maybe I didn't like the bananas or something like that. I'm having them sitting right here, it's so weird to me because this one tastes sweeter. Mm. No? Not to me. I don't like the um, I don't like the flavor of the ice cream itself. The bananas are fine, the walnuts are fine, the chocolate's okay. Mm -hmm. But um, I don't like the, the cream or whatever you want to call it, the non-dairy whatever the white stuff is. Um, 
It's I don't almond like the taste milk. Of it. Yeah, but I don't like the taste of it. It's got an odd aftertaste to it. I love it. I swear it tastes sweeter to me. That's so weird. I'm gonna go back to the regular. I hate to sit here and pig out, but I wanna make sure. No. I like the original better. Although if you were wanting to save 40 calories for, um, for a serving, mm -hmm. it's okay. I'll tell you what. I like the vegan better. Yeah. But I like the flavor of the just the bananas, just that one ingredient better in the original. That's the only thing. I was trying to catch it before it on the table, okay. but I, I didn't get there. I'm no. gross, so I'll lick it off there. Um, and that's the only thing I like better out of the original is, is the, banana, the, the banana flavor. I really, really like that vegan, and that just shocks me. Nope. Because I would not. You wouldn't. No. I'm not vegan though. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, if you're vegan, um, then you should try this. If you're just buying it to get lower calories, that's fine. But just know that you're only going to get 40 fewer calories. It's probably not worth it, honestly. Yeah, I mean, is it worth a dollar? I don't know. It wouldn't be worth flavor wise either. But that's, you think that. Ah. See, I like it. I swear it's sweeter to me. I really, really, really like it. Well, if you all have tried both, you can let us know what you think. If you've tried this new vegan uh, Chunky Monkey, I would love to hear uh, what other people have to say. Wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this little comparison. As you can see, we came away with completely different feelings about it. Uh, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching.